God never take a break on them. Let's go, right? Right. Let's go, baby. Man, you guys got an opportunity to do something right now. I'm trying to because I said something that I wanted to be the greatest to ever do. To ever do it. That's in each, that's that's inside of each one of y'all. Right there. Each one of you. The question still remains. How much time will you really waste? If I looked at my clock, if you looked at your phone, time never stops for no one. It's the one thing God don't give us. It's your time. It's your time. Touch the ball early. Let's go. Early. We done been here three years in a row. And we let this team off the hook. Make sure something tonight ain't taking you away from this moment, man. Because that's all we got. That's what y'all don't realize most of the time. We don't get this again. We don't get this again. The clock runs too fast. That's why we got to savor these moments. Because they right now. I couldn't understand that when I was 24 and 25. That's why God had to incarcerate me. So I could see how great my blessing was that he had for me. So I had to come from a jail cell being in position. To then step on a Super Bowl podium. Man. I don't do this for me. I just I watch enough film so I can put myself in position to make my defense the best defense in damn football. Right, let's go. That's why I come back every year. Part of a champion. You understand me? Ain't never how you start. Ain't never how you start. It's always how you finish. That's the way we finish football games. You understand what I'm saying? That's the way you pull your team through your team. You understand? I'm trying to tell y'all, God has never made a mistake. <laughs> He's never made one mistake. All right? So it ain't about one play. It ain't about nothing. This year, we did what we were supposed to do. We fought as a team. We fought as a team. There will be one Super Bowl champ at the end of this year. It's called Ray. Right, right. So the way we feel, somebody going to feel like that tomorrow, and somebody going to feel like that in a week. That's a fact. And the fact is, we got to come back and go to work to make sure we finish it next time. That's all we got to do. Joe, you played your ass off. Joe. You hear me, man? Joe, you played your ass off. Love Joe. Every, every drop your head when you come to a loss. Joe has never dropped his head since. That people really going through. This right here makes us strong. Let's understand who we are as a team. Let's understand who we are as men. And let's make somebody smile when we walk out of here. We got an opportunity to keep going, man. Let's be strong as a team, man. Let's be who we are. Let me tell you something. Oh yeah, I like this part right here. If tomorrow wasn't promised, what would you give for today? Right here. Forget everything else. 
Forget everything else. Forget that there was any sunlight left. What would you spend today thinking about? Yourself or the man that's beside you? Or the man that you know you'll give everything in your heart for? We get one opportunity in life. One chance in life to do whatever you're going to do. To lay your foundation to make whatever mark you're going to make. Whatever legacy you're going to leave. Leave your legacy. And it's found through effort. Wins and losses come a dime a dozen. The effort, nobody can judge effort. Because effort is between you and you. you, and you. Effort ain't got nothing to do with nobody else. So that team that think they're ready to see you, they think what they see on film, they ain't saw what film shows. Because every day is a new day. Right. Every moment is a new moment. Right. So now you got to go out and show them that I'm a different creature a different now creature than I was five minutes ago. Because yeah. I'm pissed off for greatness. Because if you ain't pissed off for greatness, greatness, that means you okay with being me to look. Ain't no man in here okay with being no. just space. Let's go, right? So let's do what we do. Let's do it. Tonight, sir. we ain't got to worry about taking no breaks. No. No, let's go, Ray. Ray, Ray just gets me going, I swear to God. I just, you know, it's like the most, um, it's almost like the most natural um, I don't want to say like most natural, gifted, uh, like preacher voice. You know what I'm saying? Like he just he I don't know. He just knows he knows what he's doing. I guess it's, you know it's just it, it, I guess it's a mixture of these things. It's like it, it's it's genuine, 100 percent genuine. It's 100 percent authentic. It, there's 100 percent energy, same passion. He's you know he's that's you you know he's he's believing it. You can feel that. You know it's it's praying. That's why praying is strong. But you know praying you have to really believe it believe it if you believe any thought with all, every energy in your soul and every every ounce of uh i guess it's really energy and belief it's really just energy and belief if you put all the amount of the, if you put your maximum amount of energy you can in the max amount of belief 100 percent belief don't doubt it for a, even a one percent a second um that's a prayer but a lot of people can't do it can't put a hundred percent the effort and energy because either they're not taking it serious or they're not taking it or they just don't know that's what you need to do they might just think you can just say a prayer well no one's like you know like a almost like we're pumping up a team no one's putting all of no one's putting the same energy that you would to pump up a team or at a motivational um speaking event no one's uh no one is putting that same energy that they would at a motivational event that they are into a prayer, but I think you have to in a prayer. You know, that's the prayer is shit. Prayer is even more important because it's for yourself. You want it to become true, and that's why. And then this is, that goes along with the thing about people's people thoughts. Thoughts becomes things for some people, but it's the same thing. If you're just kind of just believe, saying in your head and not a hundred percent believing it, it's not going to happen. And and then also some people's hundred percent believing and some people's hundred percent believing aren't the same. And then that means it comes down to your frequency, your energy, and Ray Lewis, he's he is a high high level frequency. You know the the grades all at anything they all have a high level of energy, a high frequency rate. So you mix your high level energy, the high frequency, with a hundred percent belief in your mind, not doubting it for a second. You're gonna make things happen. You're really gonna make moves happen in life. Um. Yeah, that's that. Alrighty. Well, cheers and. Like you said at the beginning, don't waste time. Don't waste a day, you know. And you know, if you gotta look, I mean, I, and if you have to look at the preacher, well, if I die tomorrow, or yeah, you know, I, I don't even think you have to look at it like that. Just, just know it's every day is important. Every single second is important. And if you're not moving, you know, if you're not doing something that's making your life better at every moment, then why are you doing it? You know, why are you doing it? If not, you're wasting this thing called life. And life, I think people, and this is, I think people are conf don't really get that, understand, or don't appreciate life. Living is amazing. You know what I'm saying? Breathing is amazing. You know what I'm saying? It's, especially if you're healthy and have your arms and legs and, you know, aren't blind and can hear. And that's fucking, you know, that's the best drug in the world. You know, it's just people, you know. But it's not their, I mean, it's not their fault, though. They're in this, they're in this, it's, we're all in this, you know, this, 
this world of you know illusions and it's, you know no one's really living for what life is and whatever you feel right here in your chest is life that's life if it feels good there you're living period period nothing else matters everything's bullshit but Live from right here. Don't care. Everything else around, anything else is, is nothing. It's really nothing. Just right here. It feels good. Bam. That's life. You can close your eyes. You, I say you. I keep closing my eyes with it because closing eyes help. You know that's why like, people looking down. Like a, John Jones, a fighter, he doesn't look the guy in the eyes when he's fighting him at the weigh-in. He, he looks down because looking at people, looking, looking at uh, making eye talk, it steals your energy. It takes your energy away. And that's why when you pray, you close. They close. They close their eyes because there's no chance taking your energy away. All your thoughts going into that. Life should be that way. If we, if everyone just took, you know, everyone's like inhale deep, like take a deep breath. If everyone would just close their eyes and take a deep breath, life would be a lot better. No one's taking deep breath. No one's really in, in closing their eyes and thinking about it like this. But anyway, all right. Peace and love.